This time, with Metal Gear Solid V, the themes are a little different from previous games in the series. We're taking on some very heavy subjects, such as race and revenge. This makes the tone much darker. As a result, I wanted Snake to have a more subdued performance, expressed through subtle facial movements and tone of voice rather than words. Furthermore, the game takes place in 1984, when Snake is 49 years old. Therefore, we needed someone who could genuinely convey both the facial and vocal qualities of a man in his late 40s. It's different from anything we've done before, so I asked a producer friend of mine in Hollywood, Avi Arad, for advice. He's the one who introduced me to Mr. Kiefer Sutherland, and I was like, why didn't I think of that? So we were at dinner in Japan celebrating the 25th anniversary of Metal Gear Solid. And we started talking about actors. And I said to him, why don't you go for Kiefer Sutherland? Whenever I think of Snake, uh, I think of a certain voice delivery. And Kiefer has this fantastic, rich uh, voice that maintain uh, a, lo a level of mystery to it. It's an honor to be able to play this character. This character has an unbelievable legacy, that there's a real personal quality to the character that I've connected to. I felt that he was the perfect fit in terms of age and performance. So, we made him an offer. I'm not a gamer, and I even knew about this game. I was certainly keenly aware of the legacy of these games, the unbelievable success of these games. Kiefer immediately understood what I was looking for. I was very moved by his commitment to the project. Well, I've never done the facial capture before where they stick all the metal dots on your face. Everything from a smile that's like, like that, or one of them is a monkey face, which is the most embarrassing to do, which is like, like that. And it's so that they can catch every line that changes in your face. The face of the character in the video game is doing exactly what I'm doing while I'm reading the script. That's impressive. In previous Metal Gears, Snake's emotions were expressed through phrases like, Kaz, are you okay? But this time, all he says is, Kaz? I wanted everything else to be expressed to the player through Snake's facial expression and vocal performance. Thanks to the top-notch acting, it's been a great success. I think it will turn out to be something truly special. A friend of mine used to be Snake, uh, but Kiefer is, uh, is a class by, by himself. Trying to isolate what does Snake want for the future? And how does the past weigh on him? There is a character's hope for a future. And that rounds out what I term as the human experience. Uh, it's what I've always loved about movies. Uh, it's not something I've experienced as a character in a video game before. As technology improves and game hardware continues evolving to adapt to these changes, we developed a new game engine called the Fox Engine. It's one step closer to creating photorealistic experiences within the context of a game. Meeting that challenge required that we shift from creating characters by hand to capturing real-life actors in 3D. By using their physical likeness along with their voice, facial expressions, and movements, we can create believable, photorealistic characters whose performances are closer to what you'd expect from live-action movies as opposed to traditional video games. That's one of the first goals I set for this game. This world differs from any other video game that I've done. And then also the technology has changed so vastly um, from the other games I've done. And, and the other games are not that old. Technically starting to cross a line uh, with what they're capable of doing and what these guys have done. It's exciting to be a part of it. We want to try to see just how far we could go in creating a truly believable, living, breathing incarnation of Snake. To the people that made the game, thank you for having me. This has been an unbelievable experience, and I hope the gamers enjoy the game as much as I have enjoyed making it. Kojima-san was able to capture a biblical proportion story. The system has been changed to embrace an open-world game design. It's different from previous stealth games and results in a more tension-packed experience. This new style of gameplay, along with the new creative process and realistic characters, will add more depth than ever before to the storytelling and atmosphere. Please look forward to the final product.